greetings today I will be showing you how to create a visual and uh, name color hack for Fantasy Star Universe on a new character of your choice so hit new game and let's get started so just choose whatever you prefer I like to go with uh, female cast now just quickly skip to the naming part okay first of all we need two things a cheat engine and the game executable with no game guard so you can actually attach the cheat engine I'll upload it, it along with the video so attach cheat engine to the exe executable go back to the game and name your character. I just go with standard linenol. Put in Unicode, search for text, input the name, and do first scan. Now we got some results here. I'll just take the first one. Now I'll go back to the game and put uh, three spaces in front of the name there we go we have six bytes free now let's add this value so to actually perform the uh, the name coloring hack you need to attach to the cheat engine debugger and to replace whatever operation here is being performed with a no operation just click replace and hit OK now it's no operation hit stop and close <coughs> now browse this memory region now you have six bytes uh, the first two are always 00f7 zero zero the following are uh, f the following four bytes are the RBG code uh, with alpha slot but uh, they don't go RPG and alpha as you normally would expect they go green red alpha and blue so I just go with dark orchard which is 9932 CC which is my favorite color by the way so green was a 32 so I put 32 in here red was 99 alpha I think I'll just max alpha and put in CC now th this should now make my check the name in game uh, dark orchid color now next to the visual hacking you need to read some bytes just keep on reading un until uh, you come to a part which goes like zero zero bytes zero zero now again zero zero byte byte zero one zero zero byte byte zero two zero zero byte byte zero three zero zero byte byte zero four in that in in that sequence so you have like six byte six four byte pairs yeah just add them do area of byte four bytes. Now I need four, and just name them by the ending, which is zero zero here, zero one, zero two. zero three and so on just just do this now close the memory viewer you have now your bytes byte pairs you need to attach the debugger once again and replace every single operation on those 
pairs with no operation. Oh, what the fuck. The hell. What the hell. Yeah. Now, once you're finished, you are good to go with visual hacking. So, um, I'll link later on a thread which has all the visual parts of various characters from the game. Basically, what you need to do is to read whatever it says like for example let's build a full seat Helga first all her parts are 9B13 so we leave the first byte untouched put in 9B13 and leave the last byte untouched too there we go we change the body do the same with rest of the stuff this was the probably the, the the texture mask or whatever it is. Those are the feet. Hair accessory. Face. and the hair itself now i now i made a full seat helga go me yeah awesome you can basically create endless combinations of characters so let's let let us make a normal helga with seat helga's hair color Now let's see nine A. Well oh, that's that's the face. What did I change? Yeah, those weird looking things up there. Yeah, make sure you don't mismatch the bytes otherwise your game will crash and you have to uh, and you have to start all over again. Wow, she just got some freaky ears. I think that will do. Yeah, I'm fine with that. Anyway, and, let, and when you're done, just hit finish. Now let's see if all worked well. And yes, it did. And there we go. This is what our character now looks in game. And the name is Dark Orchid, or colored. Now that concludes the tutorial. If you have any questions, feel free to ask. Either directly um, on YouTube or 
or post in forums. Alright guys, uh, thank you for watching, rate, comment and subscribe and you'll see more from me. Bye.